want to try it over here? Yeah. Over your space, yeah. We're trying to put the arm on it. Mm -hmm. like that. And then this, which is the light sensor. All right, my name's Tyler Perenz, and I'm one of the summer uh, robotics camp instructors here at Neshaminy High School. And the program is a multi-level program that teaches the basics of robotics, computer programming, and the engineering process. It's a five-day program where students come in for three hours, and each day they learn the different processes that go into engineering and design. So we first uh, start off by letting them build a basic robot, and from there we introduce uh, varying levels of programming so they start with basic motion of the robot and we show them how to use and program different sensors associated with the robot so the robot can do more and more complex tasks. First when I hear something it will go backwards and then, then if it hears forward. something else it will go forward mm -hmm. and then the light and, and then, then, the, and then the light will then go on. Then the light. Mm -hmm. At the end of each week, we have a challenge, depending on the level of class that they're taking, and that challenge is a culmination of all the skills that they have learned from that week. So for the basics, they have to navigate uh, a, a green, a quote-unquote green city, where they have to use alternative sources of energy and get the robot to do those different tasks. For the intermediate and advanced challenges, their challenges parallel more of the college level where they have to put out uh, simulated fires, where there's no fires actually, but it's a little red ball that they have to move, um, or they have to collect apples from trees that we have simulated in the classroom. I like like Legos you get to work with and stuff like that. Do you see yourself going into something like this when you grow up? Um, Engineering or science? I want to be a scientist, so probably. Um,